guys, so we're going to answer another video. Shut up. I mean, not another video, another message. This is my brother, my brother Chance. He's a total dork. Now, okay, because he's a whore, I thought, why not let him answer this question or have him help me answer this question? And the question is, how do you, um, how do you approach or speak to a girl, whether it be in real life or fate, like our, our online? How many, what do you want to say? I want to say... Be cocky, but don't be too cocky, because if you're too cocky, they'll see that, and then they'll be like, wow, he's he's a cocky asshole, and I don't want to talk to him. But you gotta make jokes, because jokes are really funny, and jokes make people laugh, and women love laughing, even if it's fake laughing. And make sure you never do it online, because if that's the first impression you make, that's not gonna be a good first impression, because it's just words on, on a screen, and they're not gonna look at that like, oh... You know he really wants me. No, they're they're gonna they're gonna they want face to face interaction. That's what they want. You don't want to text first. That's you never wanna good. Slowly take over the freaking phone screen. Yeah. You want to text first. You don't want to text first. That's that's not good. You want to talk face to face, or else you're not gonna get anywhere. Or you might get somewhere, but it's not gonna be anywhere like you want to be. Unless I mean you want to be like texting forever. And that's about it. Is that all you have to say? Uh, and if you want a relationship to last, make sure you don't get mad at... No, get mad at little stupid things, because that's, that's... Little stupid things. Little stupid things are all the only things that will make you mad, as long as, uh, you're happy. Wow, you're actually kind of, like, remotely serious about this. I'm surprised. And make sure you whip out your penis. <laughs> okay, get out of here. <laughs> okay, in a much more realistic way or tone you can do what my brother says um but i would not advise that as much um but i do think sorry i was getting a little comfortable here um i do think that you should be confident uh tell yourself that you can do it take a deep breath before you talk to them and just go up to them introduce yourself in a very casual man manner don't be all formal and like proper i mean you can if you really want to you know if you want to make that kind of impression on the girl um but I would just go for a very subtle, just, hey, my name is Poop, and I want to talk to you. Don't say I want to talk to you because that's a little weird. But <laughs> find something that you want to talk to them about. Or just be like, hey, is there any way that we can like get to know each other and ask for their number or something? Or find a really cool pickup line or cute pickup line and ask them or just say it to them because those are cute. I love pickup lines. They're just, they're adorable. And cheesy things about my heart. So that might work for me. Or at least a girl like me. But, um, hmm. Yeah, just take a deep breath. Be confident. And just tell yourself you can do it. I do I do want to say that you should try and make them laugh because if you make them laugh, then they feel happy and they smile and always smile, but don't do the creepy smile because that's just, that's not going to work for you. And if it does, there might be something wrong with that girl. Do I have makeup already? Oh, goodness. I'm out of it today. I'm really stressed out. I don't know why. But, um, just be, just be happy and smile and confident and make them smile. You want to make them smile and feel good about themselves because then they'll remember you. For some really weird reason, I think that works. And, uh, <laughs> why? Um, yeah, there's not really, like, a specific, like, way to approach a girl, I guess. I just, just talk to them. Introduce yourself. It's really, like, the most important thing is just do it. Just go over to them and do it. Tell yourself you can do it because you can do it. And uh, when it comes to talking to a girl online, it's actually, it's probably going to be a lot easier. Um, it's a matter of like when it comes from going to that online relationship and bringing it to the real world is kind of like when it gets a little nerve wracking. Um, but I would just be like, hey, my name's so-and-so, my name's Poop, how are you? And just kind of like make like a little quick small talk and kind of get them to smile and laugh. But don't overdo it. Like don't compliment them and overly compliment them. Don't be like... I love your eyes. Oh my god, your hair is so pretty. Oh, I love your outfit. Your butt looks really hot. Don't, don't do that because that's not going to really work that much. I don't know why, but it just won't. Unless she's a whore and then she's like, hey, I'm open 24-7 and you can come in anytime you want. I'm just kidding. But I'm just kidding. I say so much. Just, just have fun and relax. You know, you got to think about it like you got to think, I am young. Even if you're old. Even if you're an old fart. Just think, I'm young. I have all the time in the world I want. And I can mess up as many times as I want. And there will always be a girl 
that could potentially be my partner or my significant other. So just don't, just don't overthink it and believe in yourself. Be confident a little bit. Just tell yourself you can do it. Really, seriously, tell yourself you can do it. And I know you can do it. So don't you tell me, oh, I can't do it. Just trust yourself and trust me. Don't trust yourself, trust me. Trust me when I say you can do it. And when it comes to like conversations and stuff, go with whatever your gut feeling's telling you to talk about or just go with whatever's coming out. But don't let it come out like, I think you're hot, I want to be with you, oh, let's get together, let's go in the back room and let's get a bedroom kind of thing. Don't let that happen because that's sloppy. Don't do that. That's not attractive. But yeah, I hope this helped in some way. I know I'm going to sound like, oh, I don't know what I'm talking about because I really don't know what I'm talking about. Why? Because I don't know how to approach a girl. Why? Because I haven't approached a girl before. <laughs> But um, from what I know and from like what I like and what I feel is a lot more um, like I like and I'll talk to the person after is if they just like introduce themselves, like make me giggle or make me laugh, tell me a joke, make me feel like happy or funny, make me smile and give me like the flirty eyes. Eye contact is important. Make eye contact, but don't do the, don't do that. Just, just be fun and smile because that's importante. And, yeah, I'm going to get going because I'm, I'm tired and stressed. But for everyone who's thanking or wishing me happy birthday because Wednesday, November 23rd is my birthday. I don't know if you're watching that today or what because it's about to be November 23rd for me and I'm going to be uploading this video. Okay, anyway, thank you so much for wishing me happy birthday and everything like that. And for those that are saying, like, all these sweet, sweet things to my dad about me. Well, not to my dad. What am I... I cannot talk. Um, for everyone that's wishing and hoping and praying that my dad does well, thank you very, very much. Um, it really does help. And I told my dad that a lot of people hope that he gets better and everything like that. And he he's, he's so happy and he thanks all of you so much. I cannot tell you how happy I am for like to have you guys in my life. Seriously. Like, I cannot tell you. And I'll try to tell you later. But... I can't tell you right now because I can't tell you how much in this video because it's just not working. I'm going to go. I like these shoes and I'll see you later. Bye.